you are free mean? No, well, there's really nothing to it. It just means you're free. There's possibly nothing to it. What's up, YouTube? It's KBK here, and I was just kidding about the intro. Obviously, I'm going to be talking about the last panel review for AOT and the statement, you are free. I'm here to give you reasons to why, or my prediction of this statement, and why I believe my statement you know, can be somewhat correct in my, my reasons to back it up. Now, people out there in the world, they have better reasons, they have better explanations, they have better everything. These are just my silly reasons, but I hope you can see from my point of view that they somewhat make sense, and you can probably use these to come up with your own statement, which I'm perfectly fine with. You can think these are absolute trash. I don't care. But your opinions matter to me because I love constructive criticism, and I've always loved it, you know, ever since I was a little guy. and the curse of Ymir, Ymir has ended. So how does the curse of Ymir end? Well, we all know Ymir lives within the nine titan chapters. So the nine titan chapters don't really need to, to be existed anymore. How does the nine titan chapters don't exist? Because people can inherit them. Well, all the nine titan chapters are all currently, they all die, they don't pass on. So if the nine titan chapters die, the curse of Ymir dies as well. Which leads to no titans, which leads to... Possibly you are free. You know, you're free from being a titan. You can live a long, happy life. You don't have to live a short amount of life. Because when, remember, when you inherit a titan, you only have so much to live. I think it's 13 years. You only have 13 years to live instead of like, living for 50. You know, well, you're slowly dying. Therefore, you're slowly suffering when you inherit a titan. So, like, but we also understand we have, also have serum. You know, there's the pure titans. And there's the abnormal. How do they kind of disappear? Well, it's really simple, really. If you get rid of all the serums and get rid of everything, basically all the research that's being done currently, you can end this curse by getting rid of the nine titans and getting rid of all the serums in the world. You know, getting rid of all the spinal fluid, getting rid of everything you can end this curse. My second reason is you are free from suffering. Now, everybody, I mean, everybody, you know, one person, two person, three people, all the people in Elliot, all the people in Marvel, have suffered in a way, shape, or form. Uh, the people of Paradise, they suffer from being called devils from the rest of the world. You know, they only have one ally, and that's in the Asian land. Now, that's that's their only ally. The Marlins are their allies. They look at them as devils. The Marlins have suffered from being scared of those devils on Paradise. And the aliens have suffered from people judging them by their character from looking at their answers and what they did in the great fight. You know, Elias, aliens have done things terribly, but like, you gotta realize what's in the past is what's in the past. I like to bring up Gabby and the girl Sasha say from the beginning of the story. She's like, what did me and my mother do to get here? And Gabby's like, your ancestors did things, but we're not our ancestors, we're our own persons. What did we do? We're good people. And I like how slowly Gabby grew up. There were no devils in this island. Everybody realizes that the nations can all come to peace. They're just people here. And therefore getting rid of all the titans. So the thing about getting rid of all the nine titan shifters can possibly bring peace to this world. Now what about the Zeke and Aaron situation? Well I feel like Zeke and Aaron are possibly trying to do this. You know, it's probably Zeke's secret plan. But that's for another video. You know, if and you know, if all the nations come together, everybody can be at peace, which leads to you are free from suffering and being a titan and living a long happy life. You can live a long happy life and don't have to live a short life. We could meet Historia's baby. You know, we don't know who impregnated her. You know? And then finally, people from all the nations finally realize what happened in the past. And the titans no longer exist and it can bring forth a new, brighter future. Everything that's happened in AOT so far, but the end, this suffering needs to stop. I mean, the people have suffered for far too long. The people have suffered the most, possibly, is probably Aaron, Zeke, and Ryder. Possibly, that's just my opinion. That's
half hour wraps up this video. You know, if you like this, hit the like button. If you dislike this, hit the dislike button. I'm gonna see you in the next video. Hit the subscribe button and hit Raylo for more content like this. I'm signing out. Bye bye. Aaron had to get shot though. You know, it's. If he dies, next chapter confirmed. I'm just kind of done.